Let's compare the decimals 0 0.1 here and 0 0.25. And here's how we do that. So what we'll do is we'll look at the tenths place. So we're going to look at the first digit after the decimal place. So here it's 1. Here the first digit after the decimal place is 2. And that means that 0 0.25, that's going to be larger than 0 0.1. Sometimes it's helpful to think about having a zero after this so you can see the 25 is larger than the 10. But either way, 0 0.1, that is less than 0 0.25. You may be asked to use fractions to figure this out, and we could do that too, because we could just call this 10 over 100. This would be 25 over 100. With fractions, since we have the same denominator here, we're just going to compare the numerators. And 25 is larger than 10. So 25 over 100, that's larger than 10 over 100, as is 0 0.25, that's larger than 0 0.1, or if you called it 0 0.10. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.